Hey, it's the Fuck Ups Christmas Show! home already. Huh? I thought you was working at the mall, playing Santa Claus. Uh, yeah, I got fired. What the fuck? They said I had to wear pants. Mm. Oh shit, fucking pants. Can you believe it? Believe it, fucking makeup, baby. I'm just another unemployed schlub who can't afford to buy myself Christmas gifts. Boom, boom. Shit, and I'm almost out of Uncle Mike's shitty ass brandy. This Christmas is fucking stupid. Oh, that reminds me. Uncle Mike wants to know if we got any figgy pudding. Figgy fucking what? Figgy pudding, not sack. It's a holiday treat. So is Katy Perry in a damn Santa bikini. But we ain't got that either. Hey, when's the little hussy getting here? I feel like getting sloppy with her. Just one more thing to add to my list of regrets. Hey, lighten up, butt stink. This is a Christmas party. Have some good cheer. Don't mind if I fucking do. I have a great idea. How about a song to lift the old spirits? Little drummer boy? Yeah, right. A shot of rum or tuba, ba 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 It's played out next. Ha, yeah, or better yet, we get three French hens, two turtle doves, and a fucking partridge just shit in our fucking ears so we don't have to listen to that long as fuck stupid effing song ever again. <clears throat> Seriously, who gets a gaggle of fucking birds for Christmas? That's the booze talking. That song is a classic about singing Frosty the Damn Snowman or Rudolph the Motherfucking Reindeer. Yeah, I just finished off the rest of Uncle Mike's hooch. I'll do Rudolph. I'm sorry, but could you repeat that? I said I'm gonna do Rudolph. <laughs> That's what I thought you said, King <laughs> Perf. <laughs> Very fucking funny. Do you want me to sing this fucking song or not? I guess it's that damn brandy. But I feel committed to making a total fucking mess of myself. Take it or leave it, you shits. Okay, okay. Shh, shh. This is gonna be good. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, here we go. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer had a crazy shiny nose. And if you ever saw it, your mind would be literally blown. All of the shithead reindeers laughed their asses off at his looks. They just fucked with poor Rudolph, not knowing he'd be in the history books. Then one time on Christmas evening, Santa came and said, Rudolph, with your flashlight nose, you can lead my sled instead. Then all the dickhead reindeers acted like they liked his face. Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer put those assholes right in their place when he got to that sled like a fucking champ. Damn, big baby. That was fucking beautiful. I know. It's a gift. Do Frosty now. Yeah, do fucking Frosty. Settle down, little ones. An artist must never be rushed. That's what Uncle Mike said to me this morning when I tried picking him up off the bathroom floor. <clears throat> okay, let's do this. Frosty the Showman Snowman. Frosty the Snowman was a jolly so-and-so With a fully packed pipe and a fucked up nose And a penis made of snow. Frosty the Snowman was inappropriate, adults would say But he was breaking no laws by flashing his balls And the kids loved that anyway. Well, there must have been some magic in that fucked up hat they found For when they hung it from his junk He began to prance around. Hey, Frosty the Snowman was a nutcase, yes indeed The children would see Frosty poop and pee And it made them happy be as can be. Humpity hump hump humpity hump hump look at that fucker go. Humpity hump hump humpity hump and his junk's made out of snow. Then the sun came out melted his ass. The end. So what? The hat wasn't really magic? Hell yes it was magic. He was dancing and prancing around with his fucking junk wasn't he? Yeah but then he just melted. I mean couldn't they just put the damn hat on top of his fucking puddle and pop him back to life again? Wait a minute. Makeup baby's right. Why couldn't they keep his creepy ass alive if they had a fucking magic hat? How the fuck do I know? Maybe he's still alive and wearing a fucking invisibility cloak somewhere. Where'd he get a Dudes like that are always hiding shit like that. So you're saying he's not dead? He's just lurking around the fucking neighborhood and no one can even see the weirdo? Kinda creepy, right? Frosty makes me think of Uncle Wexel. Christmas is scary. Ah! What the fuck was that? Wexel. Fucking Frosty? Ah! <laughs> Holy shit! It's the real Santa! Let him in, let him in, let him in! Oh, oh, oh yo! Go down, little fella. I have gifts for all y'all. Ho, ho, ho. Has everybody been good this year? Oh, shit. Uh, we've been good, Santa. We've been good. We've been pretty good. We've been okay. Ho, ho, ho. I know you've had some struggles this year. Big Baby, I heard you lost your job playing me at the mall. <laughs> I hope it's not because you scared the little children away. Well, that was part of it, Santa. The other part was that I wasn't wearing any pants. Well, listen. I've been keeping an eye on all y'all. Ho, ho, ho. Especially you, Domino, because you are humble, kind, and so very cute. <laughs> but you other fuckers gotta go easy on shit like cussing and boozing and cigarette token. Moderation, boys. 
<laughs> That's what Mrs. Claus has been beating in this silly old head of mine for 200 fucking years. I'm sure you'll try a little harder next time. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, oh, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, and uh, stay out of Uncle Mike's tackle box and uh, help your mother around the house once in a while. Well, let's see what's in your bag before we cut any deals. That shit's looking pretty skimpy. Oh, oh, oh. here you go, boys. Just do your best, and I'll see you next year. <laughs> Thanks, Anna. Thanks, Anna. You're the greatest. No, oh, y'all are the greatest. Ho, ho, ho. Till next year, you little shits. Oh, man. Prancer's ass pellets. These are delicious. Hey, look, Domino got a chocolate sun bitch. That's her absolute favorite. I wonder what I got. A candy bastard? Hot damn! Santa really knows how to choose them. Whoa, this is huge. Dick the fucking get it. Huh? Fucking undies. How's fucking underpants a present? Santa screwed me. Damn, big baby. You should be happy that Santa even stopped here. Man, that fucker just doesn't get me. Maybe your shitty attitude is the problem. Maybe undies are all you're worth. That means I'm worth a candy bastard. If Santa can't give me what I want, maybe little hussy can. And if there's one chick who likes surprises, it's her. She likes them nasty. That's probably her. Where's the fucking mistletoe, you apes? Um, right here, Huss. Uh, Merry Christmas. Uh, I got you some candy. <laughs> oh, big baby, are you flirting with me? How fucking sweet. Go ahead, reach in and grab some. <laughs> That's right, grab a big damn handful. It's stuck. <laughs> there's something stuck in here. Tug on it. Tug my ass. This shit is fucking stuck. It's hard as a rock. Can someone give me some pliers? Whoa, slow down. Give me a hand, makeup baby. This mess is stubborn. You're on your own with that one. Must be taffy. I'm pulling and pulling and it won't budge. Bring me a damn ratchet wrench. Hey, we're not fixing a flat tire here. Follow my lead. Chugga 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 chugga. Well, how much do you want me to pull it, big baby? Till the Pole Express makes its final stop. And where is that, big baby? Oh, you might have been there. It's a little place called Boner Town, USA. <laughs> Fuck it. I quit. I can't get this shit up. Just hand me the box. I'm going over Limpy's. He can help me pry the shit loose. Oh, hell no, don't, uh, don't take this to Limpy's. I, I mean, uh, you might get jealous or some shit. Leave me the box here and I'll give you some different candy next time you come over. Oh, do you mean it? You're all the candy I need, big boy. But you can have another box ready for me for the next time I come. Well, don't worry. I'll have a box ready every time you come over. Now fucking skedaddle. Beat it. Fine. Merry fucking Christmas. <laughs> Hello? Big baby. baby. What the fuck are you doing home? I thought you were working at the mall all day. Uh, yeah, long story, Ma. Something to do with my outfit and children were crying and I was making out with this hot little number dressed as a sex elf. So they gave me the rest of the day off. Well, Uncle Mike wanted to spend Christmas with me eating goddamn figgy pudding and drinking fucking eggnog. So tell his drunk ass not to drink all the brandy before I get there. In the meantime, Uncle Mike, ask Uncle Mike for a few minutes to the grocery store and buy some figgy pudding for when I get home. I want a nice fucking Christmas for once. Okay, Ma, whatever you say, don't worry. I got it covered. The slots are shutting down early tonight, so I'll be coming straight home. I'm drunk and broke, and I want a respectable fucking Christmas for once. I know, Ma. Gotta go. Who the fuck knows what goes in figgy pudding? Do you? What are you asking me for? Do you? Don't look at me! Do you? I'll take that as a no. No one knows what's in figgy pudding! Exactly, Peckerhead. Now here's the fucking deal. We go wake Uncle Mike, tell him Ma's on our way home, and we're gonna give them the best Christmas present ever. The only catch is, we need some cash for ingredients. But the thing is, we don't use the cash for ingredients, we use it for booze. We get a bottle for their disgusting ass eggnog, and a bottle for us to celebrate the holiday the way it was meant to be celebrated, butthouse fucking drunk! Well, what about the figgy ingredients? Well, that's just it, makeup baby. We already have the fucking ingredients. Huh? These. Yeah, and he told me to stick them in my and Uncle Mike's fucking pudding. I didn't hear him say that. Yeah, well, I emailed him about a week ago asking for a pair of fucking underpants for Christmas. Then he said only if I shared them like every good boy and girl should do. But why would you share your underwear? Tis the season, motherfucker. Anyway, Santa's watching right now to see if you forked the shit over or if he should just give you a lump of fucking reindeer turd next go-round. Okay, well, if Santa said so... Now, Peckerhead, take this shit to the kitchen and add whatever else you can find. Then bake that fucker up. Makeup, baby. Go get some cash from Uncle Mike and head straight to the liquor barn. Yes, who the fuck made you, boss? Santa signed me this roll. This was all addressed in the email. Now get cooking, Jingle Balls. Hey, 30 minutes later. It's done, big baby. The fucking pudding's done. Well, this is it, boys. I think we just did the most Christmassy thing in the history of Christmassy shit. Santa would be very proud of us. Maybe he's looking at how good we are right now. And we'll come back tonight and give me another candy bastard. Yeah, and he would bring me another box of ass pellets. And Domino, her chocolate sun bitch. Probably not. But in the meantime, maybe dickheads would like to join me in a song. Domino? We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Blah, 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 blah. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Blah, blah, blah. 
blah, blah. Tiny whiteys we bring for you and your kids. Tiny there are tiny whiteys and a blah, 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 blah. A bottle of brandy for 261. A bottle of brandy makes Christmas more fun. Then we'll make you some figgy pudding. We'll make you some figgy pudding. We'll make you some figgy pudding. Blah, 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 blah. We won't know until you taste some. We won't know until you taste some. We won't know until you taste some. If it tastes like pure shit. Oh, 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 oh,